Don't Break Down is a direct book that shows you how to get past pain, stress, and disappointment that comes from a broken love affair. And D. Yvonne Young is here to directly answer your questions on relationships. Do you mind taking some time and answering some questions? No. If you're in a relationship with someone and someone does something to break your trust, how do you regain that person's trust and move on with the relationship? In many instances, trust is like a piece of china. Once broken, it's at best difficult to repair. And even if you do repair it, it's not going to be the same. So my first revelation is don't break someone's trust. Trust is precious and you cannot easily fix it. The second thing is if you are mature enough and your faith is strong enough to forgive, remember you have to forgive and you have to forget. One does not work without the other. So in a nutshell, the first answer is don't lose the trust. And then if you do lose it, be prepared for the hard work that it's going to take to regain it because it will be an uphill battle. The next question. How do you cope with the breakup when your ex-spouse has moved on, he's in another relationship, and you have become the sole parent raising your children and dealing with all of the other stresses? The first thing is remember that kids are people too, and that at different ages, children have a different ability to reason. So the conversation that you will have with a three-year-old, you don't have with a 13-year-old. They have totally different values, totally different concerns, but the one thing they have in common is the ability to be stressed out. So number one, you must assure your child, no matter the age, that their lifestyle to the degree possible is not going to change. The second thing is, after you talk to your child, understand that this isn't easy for them too because they are likewise a human being. And tell your relatives to create a safe zone, meaning that you cannot talk about the other parent, neither can the in-laws talk about you. Children need to feel safe whether they're with you or with, their, with your ex-spouse. And last but not least, let's look at the risks that come when we don't treat our children like this. If they're teenagers or adolescents, you are setting up the door for promiscuity, for them to join gangs, and for them to be influenced even by pedophiles because they have no safe place to go with the people that should love them. So they will find, just like you, when you don't feel loved, you will find love. You will get in where you fit in. So will your child. Yvonne, it has been a pleasure as usual, and I've learned so much. Where can people go to get the very practical breakup, don't break down? You can go to my website at dyvonneyoung.com and pick up a copy or at any better retail bookstore.